In my last video, I used this integrated circuit in the breadboard right there. This one sticks in the board pretty well. Usually I can uh, pluck them out with my fingers pretty easily. I probably could with this one still, but I'm going to show you a better way to remove them. So first off, we're going to take a little screwdriver here and just uh, kind of twist it a little bit. So you want to, you don't want to like lift like that. It'll pop out, bend the end pins right there. You just kind of want to twist it a little bit like that lever it up just a little bit going each uh, direction right there and uh, that's probably about as far as we want to go and then we'll go to the other side it helps to kind of wedge that side there so they don't sink back in and uh, there you go and uh, so it seems to kind of favor that side popping out a little bit more now we can be a little more careful and uh, remove them so we don't want to have that action going when some of the pins are in the board it'll bend those end pins right there you just kind of want to slowly lever up each side so that each side is coming out uh, relatively evenly. So in any case, just thought I'd make a quick video on that and uh, hope you enjoy. Make sure you check out one of the other videos I'm posting on the screen. Click like, subscribe, the bell, all that. If you can donate, please do. That'll help out the most. I have links down in the description, but otherwise watching videos are great. Thank you for watching them. I'll see you in the next video.